I'm Mrs. Vasquez, your school therapist. You know what today is? It's World Mental Health Day. World Mental Health Day is every year on October the 10th to raise awareness about mental health around the world and to mobilize our efforts to support those experiencing mental health issues. And that makes all of us. We all face stress and it's important to find ways to stay balanced and healthy. When you're feeling stressed, try taking deep breaths or going for a walk. Physical activity can really help to relieve tension and hobbies like drawing or reading or listening to music are great ways to relax. Self-care is super important. Make sure that you're getting enough sleep at least eight hours every night and eat healthy meals and setting aside time just for you can make such a big difference. Talking to someone is also a great way to feel better. Stay connected with your friends and family or even a trusted teacher or counselor if you need support. Have you tried mindfulness or journaling? Taking a few minutes to just take some deep breaths or write down your thoughts can help clear your mind and you can feel more relaxed. It's okay if things are overwhelming. It's okay to ask for help. Whether it's talking to a counselor, a therapist, a teacher, or any trusted adult, it's really important to get the support when you need it. Spartans, I hope you find these simple but powerful tips helpful. Remember that taking care of your mental health is just as important as taking care of your physical health. So until next time, work hard, stay curious, and spread kindness like confetti. Have a great day, Spartans. Hey Spartans! My name is Savannah Velasquez and Zoe Gomez. Today's date is October 10th of 2024. This week's Care at the Couch call is never look down on anybody unless you're helping them up by Jesse Jackson. Hey Savannah, what color are your jeans? Oh, blue like the American flag. Let's say the pledge. Please stand. Place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now here's the daily news. What kind are you? The welcoming kind? Isn't that the girl from our science class? Hi! The inclusive kind. Let's do this. Come on, David. Let's dance! The friendly kind. Yeah. Oh, let's see them. Yo, those are dope. Jeez. The respectful kind. Yeah. Kindness. Everyone deserves kindness. Become a part of it at messstopbullying.org. using Powtoon.
Hey Spartans, I'm Nally Reyes, some of you know me as Nat, and I'm running for ANSB president. Why should I vote for you? Reason number one, I'm responsible. And we're gonna need someone who's responsible to be president this year, and that's gonna be me. But I don't even know you. Well, that brings me to reason number two. I'll hear out your problems and I'll help in any way I can. But do you even have any experience? Well, that brings me to reason number three. This is my second year in ASB. I know how the job works. I know what president does. I'm prepared. So how many votes should I get? Plus 10. Plus 10. Plus 10. As many as we can. inspiring messages. By you coming here, it's a blessing for everyone. So, see you at the conference! If you want to come out to learn the Thriller Dance for the Pep Rally on October 31st out on the basketball courts, come to the gym on October 24th, Thursday, October 24th from 2.45 to 3.45 p.m. If you can't make it, it's okay. Scan the QR code to learn the dance. See you there, Spartans. Calling all artists. Have you heard about reflections? What? You know, reflections? What the heck is reflections? The art competition? Art competition? Yeah, reflections is an art contest where you can be recognized for your creativity through different forms of art, such as dance, choreography, film production, literature, music composition, photography, and visual arts. This year's theme is accepting imperfection. Oh, kind of like the leaning tower of Pisa only got popular for its engineering mistake? That's a great example. There is a winner for each uh, category, and if your art is the only submission for that category, you win. Winners compete at district, region, state, and even national level. Wait, can you submit more than one category? Of course you can. 
Another great question, where can I submit? Great question. The flyer down below has a QR code where you can submit your work. It also has a link for more information and an email to go to for any questions. There will also be extra flyers in the library. When is it due? Thanks for reminding me. The due date is October 15th and no later than that. Okay, Hul, this sounds really fun. Well, that's because it is. And we want you to join in that fun so, so you, can, you can make a reflection, get creative, creative and turn it in before, before it's too late. late. Once again, I'm Savannah Velasquez. And I'm Zoe Gomez. Today's day is October 10th of 2024. This week's Character Counts Koi is never look down on anybody unless you're helping them up by Jesse Jackson. Adios, Spartans!